And welcome back to another round of Dead by Daylight. We're on Mount Ormond here early in the morning in some DVD at three and the sweat is real. Triple hook offerings. I'm not even gonna go through the usual jokes about why we're here. We're here because the survivors are sweaty. And because they want to have things to be mostly in their favor and it's probably a Sabo squad. So we're gonna play appropriately. A boon has gone up. My guess is that's exponential. Whatever. Okay. Not my obsession, so. That's a, not a particularly good start for you there, buddy. Like I said, this is a Sabo squad. I don't think they realize the hooks don't, the hook offerings don't stack. We uh we brought a Mori because we actually have a daily. All right. So yeah, we're not going to play very nice. All right, we're going to go get a hat on Kate. All right. We had to lose a few, say, the best for last stacks, unfortunately. Fine. Drop her on the ground, Neil. You better hope to. All right. Hey, Kate. Yeah, I don't have any problem leaving Kate here on the ground to bleed out. Prefer to find the Vittorio. They broke undying at some point, probably for that boon. Nia, you've been an annoyance so far. And you have no power up here. Where about that, Neil? All right, we're going right back for the cape. A 
Unfortunately, my ruin totem is back here. Oh, yeah. Oh, Nia. I can hear you, Nia. We can hear you there, Nia. I believe this hook has come back. Oh, yeah, that's a mistake. That's because you got your trap off. I think you're, uh... Or give you another hat. How about that? Give you something to think about. All right, Kate's hat's off. Steve's never gotten one. He is the obsession. We are literally saving him for last. Remember, Vittorio and Kate are both dead? No, Nia and Vittorio are both dead. Oh, that's an active trap. Is an active trap. This is going to be two hooks on everybody but the Steve. Let's uh, get this over with quickly. Ah, it's a raise quit. You raise quit. What a coward. What a, ch what a coward. Oh, I'm sorry. Your triple, uh, Your triple map off, or your uh, triple hook off, right? And you're gonna raid squid. Oh my god, you children. Ah! Oh yeah. <laughs> Killing you too. Ah! You wanna raid squid as well? Steve luckily finds the hatch. We have a 75% chance of killing somebody who uh, brought a storm on and a 50% chance that we killed the uh, person who brought the uh, the map offering that DC'd. Uh, we got our daily done as the pig. 
I honestly, I don't know what these survivors expected. Uh, let's see. The Kate Rage quit. She's one of the ones that brought the oak. The Steve is the one who brought the uh, who brought the map offering. But this was obviously a four-person survive with friends. They had the whole they had the whole plan lined up. Triple petrified oaks. The uh, the Kate had a commodious toolbox with Sabo stuff to go with it. Vittorio had Alex's toolbox with Sabo stuff. Nania had Sabo stuff. Breakdown on Steve. Breakdown on Kate. Breakdown on Vittorio. Breakdown on Nia. Exponential on Nia. Saboteur and Vittorio and Kate. This was a team that wanted to try out the new Sabo build, I guess, or at least the new Sabo toolboxes since they got buffed. And, well, the problem is they went up against a pig that wasn't going to play by their rules. Uh, we ignored the Steve. We had saved the best for last and rapid brutality. It made sense for us to hit people other than the Steve, which is what we did. We got two hooks on everybody but Steve before we started mooring people out of the match. And, again, why? Vittorio and Kate, he used the hook offerings. One, which doesn't work like this. This does not triple stack. A lot of people don't realize that, but these do not triple stack. They only go so much, and you can use one and get the same effect as you do as you do with three. So one, you 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 already are doing it wrong. Uh, by the way, that was three exponentials, I think. I don't know if I said K had it too. All all three of these at the bottom did. Uh, you bring a map offering to stack it in your favor by sending me to Ormon, which is obviously a survivor-sided map. You run all this Sabo stuff to try to deny hooks, and then you rage quit when you don't get your way, and it looks like you're going to lose the match. What babies. Now, the Vittorio and the Kate, boy, I hope grade school is treating you better than this match at EBD did, because, boy, you were poor. You were epitome of a sore loser. Uh, at least the uh, at least the Nia hung around and and accepted her fate and took her Mori and uh, Steve got lucky the hatch was right there he literally had to run just a few feet and hatch was there and we and obviously he wasn't injured we had no chance to close it or get him down but you know what with this survive with friends and there's all Sabo build sending us to Ormond I'll be more than happy to Mori three fourths of your group and call that a W any day of the week. In this DVD at three with Piggy on Ormon will take the W. Hope you enjoyed the round. Please consider hitting the like and subscribe button while you're here. New videos go up on the channel on a daily basis. And you can follow us over on Twitch at the link below at Geriatric Gaming 11 and get notified whenever we're live there. Till the next time. Thanks again so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you in the next Dead by Daylight.